Okay, I just got home and I found this parcel left in front of my flat, so I think it's my eBay haul. Some great art on the back of the box. Don't want to show the geezer's address. I've cut my address off. So I'm going to get this open. And we can have a quick look and see what's inside. So I've opened the top of the shoe box. Let's see what's in here. Yeah. It's two UKG graded figures. Um, I'm sure action figure grader can guess what they are. Uh, it's from the same seller, I believe. I've got that Princess Leia and. Um, Call it Princess Leia. So here's the first one. There we are, it's a Hoff Rebel soldier. It's got some wear on the paint. It's a Spanish POC figure. So you know I've got the PBP dark brown version, so this is the Spanish POC version. And then let's look at the next figure. Here's the next figure. This is a Dengar figure. It's the Spanish P -P PBP version of uh, Dengar. So it's the pale face version. PBP 1980 Noku UKG 80 Yep, that's good because he had two of these. He had one that was a UKG 75 and this was the 80, so this is the correct one. I'd have been rather upset if I, he'd sent me the 75 by mistake. So that's the Spanish PBP Pale Face Dengar. And then there's the POC. So you've got the whole history of Spanish vintage Star Wars. You've got the POC, P O C H, or POSH, and then the PBP. So that's a 70 UKG, and this is an 80. Dengar's a lot more common than the Pock Rebel Soldier. Here's a good look at the uh, Pock Rebel Soldier. So you can see there's a lot of paint loss, but that's common with these Spanish figures that paint often flakes. So it says Star Wars Rebel Soldier Pock 1980, Lucasfilm Limited, Hong Kong. So these figures were moulded in Hong Kong but painted in Spain. So it will have the Hong Kong date stamp on the leg. There's the blaster. Here's the figure. Pock Hoff Rebel Soldier. Here's the Dengar. So this is often called the Dark Armor Pale Face Dengar. It's quite common in the UK, this figure. I think he's quite common on the Tri Logo card. So it's the uh, Dengar PBP 1980 Lucasfilm Limited No Ku Figure 80 Paint 80 Dengar the Bounty Hunter. Pretty cool figure. There's the back of the figure. So there's a nice PVP figure. Not hard to find. I think Action Figure Grader could find one of these in 10 minutes. And it would be an 85. And it would be cheaper. Okay.
So that's the Dengar um, PvP. And this is the um, Pock Hoff Rebel Soldier. So you've got this history of um, Spanish vintage Star Wars there. First there was the POC, then the, came the PBP. So pretty cool. Both Empire Strikes Back figures. I mean, I like it's dark now in England. It's really night. It's like uh, ten to seven, so it's really dark. And um, oops. So. Um, like to see this in more natural light, this figure, because the face looks so pale. Whereas his is a lot more pinker. And when I did the comparison with the Dark Brown Rebel Soldier, which is the PvP version, you'll see how pale his face is compared to this. So figure and paint on this one get both 70. I think this is quite a rare figure. Again I was going for the PVP cow car pilot. And that just went too high. So I won this one first. And then I thought I'd go for the Dengar as well. Very good, nice figures. Okay. So, yeah, if you need further information about these figures, please ask Action Figure Grader. Alright, cheers, goodbye.